You know, when I look like a Muslim, you expect things from me, if you're a good Muslim, to be exactly as Islam has taught. The minute you see me, you expect a truthful person, a person who's of high standards, high morals, high values, a person who helps others, a person who's not judgmental of others. Are we really that way? It is supposed to be a part of the package. The minute you speak to someone, even if it's over the phone, and the name happens to be Muhammad. For example, a common name. The name happens to be Muhammad. Who are you? You're an ambassador, not just of Islam, but even your name is Muhammad, peace be upon him. Named after the Prophet, peace be upon him, right? Muhammad. Imagine if you were a person who did not work on your bad habits, if you harmed people, if you never helped others, if you never reached out to those who harmed you, then what was the point of giving yourself that name? Or why did your parents give you that name? Subhanallah. No wonder we call each other Mo and Mo because we're embarrassed. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala grant us ease. When I speak of the package, you know, we speak, I, I've mentioned the word package four or five times. The reason is we're supposed to be Muslim. The minute I'm a Muslim, you know, you need to know what's inside. I give you one little example in the form of a light statement. So they say there was a teacher, English teacher. The English teacher is asking the students to make sentences with words. So the teacher says, make a sentence with sugar in it. So someone says, I had sugar in the morning. Another one says, you're as sweet as sugar. Someone else says something else. And one boy puts up his hand. He says, I drank tea in the morning. So the teacher says, where's the sugar? You know what he says? It's in the tea. <laughs> It's in the tea. That's a package. Subhanallah. I had my tea in the morning. Where's the sugar? The sugar is inside. Didn't you say, make a sentence with sugar in it? Well, the sugar was in it. Subhanallah. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala grant us goodness. The reason I say it's a package is because with us, you're a Muslim. Well, where's the sugar? It's supposed to be in you. The problem with us is, we're on artificial flavoring. Mashallah. Sweetness. <laughs> May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala make us sweet. Wallahi, to be sweet is a good quality. To be sweet, especially to the right people. Here we are speaking about Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. His words, his actions are all there to prove his words. That's why he says, the best from among you are those who are best to your family members and I am the best to mine. From among you, I'm the best. Subhanallah. Which means he lived up to what he said. Many of us preach one thing and we live another. And this is where we falter and this is where we actually go wrong.